Now your WMBD Morning Rush. Non-stop news, weather and traffic to start your day. We begin with a follow up after a month of questions. The body found earlier this month in Peru, Illinois has been identified as missing Illinois State University graduate student Jelani Day. The LaSalle County coroner made the announcement yesterday. However, the investigation is not over yet. WMD's Austin Schick joins us live now from Bloomington with the latest details. Good morning, Austin. Well, good morning, Matt. Good morning, Kyrian. And investigators say it was thanks to forensics that they were able to identify the body as 25 year old Jelani Day. Now, forensics meaning dental records as well as DNA testing and comparison. However, with all that, police still say it's too soon to give an exact cause of death adding that is still listed as unknown at this time, pending further investigation as well as toxicology testing. Now, a BPD spokesperson would not release the state the body was found in, saying it's still too soon, though, to say whether foul play is involved, saying this could or could not be a homicide. Now, of course, here we were covering the Jelani Day disappearance almost daily, but after news of Gabby Petito's disappearance, that's when news of Jelani's disappearance was really garnering attention from the national news media, as well as celebrities and national news figures. Now, Officer Furman with BPD says when you have someone as beloved as Jelani, it's bound to be in the headlines. I'm glad that it's getting media attention. It helps us with our investigation, and it also helps bring awareness to other missing people. Um, I can tell you that a lot of people are starting to look at different missing persons around their community and here locally and asking. Now, Furman reminds people this is still an active investigation and not all details will be immediately, re immediately re re released. And police in Bloomington and Peru are still looking for credible tips. And of course, when we learn more in the next days and weeks, we of course will keep you updated here at WMBD and on CIProud.com. For now, live in Bloomington, Austin Chick, back to you guys.